Disability History, Panel 3, 1620 through 1768 A.D. Involvement by People with Disabilities, Survival as Outcasts, and Beggars. Persons with disabilities are treated as social problems and public burdens. They that go down to the sea in ships, that do business in great waters, these see the works of the Lord and wonders in the deep. For he commandeth and raiseth the stormy wind, which lifteth up the waves thereof. They mount up to the heaven, they go down again to the depths. Their soul is melted because of trouble. They reel to and fro and stagger like a drunken man, and are at their wit's end. Psalm 107 Connection to Different Time in History From a social viewpoint, disability was closely linked to poverty, a condition that existed in ancient times and continues today, where the rate of unemployment for persons with disabilities is now over 65%. Connection to Different Time in History St. Mary's of Bethlehem, a large asylum in London, better known as Bedlam, had windows opening onto the sidewalk, allowing passers-by to witness the people living within. Moral Viewpoint At times, persons with disabilities were shipped off to other lands so they would no longer pose a burden on their communities. These boats would sail from port to port, charging admission to view their strange human cargo. Eventually, the ships would abandon their passengers at another port, forcing them to fend for themselves. Some argued that the fresh sea air had a curative effect. Connection to different time in history. Similar arguments have been used for locating institutions away from the community, where the air was apparently fresher and had soothing effects upon the inmates. Moral Viewpoint Fool a. A person with little or no judgment. B. A man, formerly kept in the household of a nobleman or king, to entertain by joking and clowning. A victim of a joke or trick. Connection to different time in history. St. Mary's of Bethlehem, a large asylum in London, better known as Bedlam, had windows opening onto the sidewalk allowing passers-by to witness the people living within. Stereotype Burdens of Charity People with disabilities are viewed as clients entitled to food and shelter and little else. The disability is often viewed as punishment for some sin, and any help rendered is more from contempt than sympathy. Persons with disabilities receiving this cold charity are viewed as draining public resources and are expected to show proper appreciation. Moral Viewpoint Between 1563 and 1601, Queen Elizabeth of England passed a series of laws requiring the state to take care of the poor and disadvantaged. Basic care was provided for the unemployable poor, almshouses were established for the aged poor, and workhouses were built for vagrants who refused to work. Many with disabilities were placed in almshouses or workhouses where the conditions were grim. Connection to a different time in history. A modern parallel can be drawn to our institutions of the 1950s and 1960s, where a larger number of persons were admitted to meet a growing demand for services, resulting in dehumanizing conditions and a poor quality of life. 